Subscribe to us for more exciting updates. Here's how you can recreate this cinematic trailer like in the movies. Here's how we do it. First, create a new project and select all the images you want to use. Once you have your images imported, tap on the trim icon and lower the duration to 1.2 seconds. Tap on this double tick icon and apply the change to all images. Next, tap on this icon over here to add transition between the images. Select the move down option. Similarly, tap on this double tick icon and apply changes to all layers. Tap on save to export it as a video file. Next, to create the text layer. Create a new project and select the black background. Tap on text and type in your header for the effect. Size up your text. Extend the duration of the entire project to about 10 seconds minimally. Tap on save to export it as a video file. Finally, to put them all together, create a new project. Go to PIP and import the image slideshow you've created. Tap fill to fit it to screen. To sped up the video, go to speed and tap on the curve selection. Tap on this preset drop-down menu here and select this curve. Adjust if necessary. Next, import your text video using PIP. Tap fill to fit it to screen, followed by blend and select darken. Go to the 6 second mark and tap on the keyframe icon. Move to the beginning and scale the text to the maximum. Swipe right at the functions and select the curve option for the keyframes. Tap on cubic for a more gradual and smoother scaling. Next, using animation, select the fade in option and extend the effect duration to about 2 seconds. There you have it. Add music, effects, and materials to spice up your video. Try it on you cut.